welcome to my first ever time playing Dark Souls. It's Dark Souls Remastered. I have to thank my good buddy McBlam for giving me a copy of this game a really long time ago. As a, I think it was a birthday gift like two or three years ago. And uh, I never got around to playing it, but tonight we are going to. And it's going to be... Fun? <laughs> I hope. And now we get to create our character. I forgot we got to do this. Oh, yeah. Uh... Okay, so our character. I'm gonna call him one of my favorite Fire Emblem characters and a name that I've used for other things since then. Garrick. Do you like that name? Oh, okay. there he is. He has green hair. Okay, well, there you go. You can safely have green hair. Class. Okay, so this is important, I think, but I have no idea what any of these actually do. So, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, okay, that's what we're gonna do, I think. I'm gonna, ch I'm just gonna cheap out and go through the tankier one, I think, to start with. I mean, it probably doesn't matter that much. I'm gonna get one shot by most things anyway, because I have no idea what I'm doing. But the way this game is, is it kind of lends itself to playing it more than once, so... And there's also Dark Souls 2 and 3, which I have, and Bloodborne, and then Elden Ring, which just came out, which I don't have, but by the time I'd get to that, yeah. So there's possibilities of us doing other builds and other games, too, so... I'm just gonna go Knight, I think. Alright, so Gift. That what just gave me probably more information than I deserved. But they said you can get the key later in the game before you would actually need it anyway. And that it said, hint, hint, the pendant is the way to go because it helps you get a special item. Well, then I guess I'll go with that. I wouldn't have had that information. <laughs> so I, I almost feel bad knowing that. But apparently I can get a master key before I would need one. And... The pendant will help me out later, so, boom. Alright, I think we're finally ready to dive into this madness. Oh boy, I don't know if I'm ready, but here we go. Yep. Oh, we're gonna go cutscene mode for this. In the age of ancients, the world was unformed, shrouded by fog. A land of grey crags, arch trees, and everlasting dragons. But then there was fire. And with fire came disparity. Heat and cold. Life and death. And of course, light and dark. Then from the dark, they came and found the souls of lords within the flame. The first of the day. The witch of Isolith and her daughters of Chaos. Gwyn, the Lord of Sunlight and his faithful knights. And the furtive pygmy, so easily forgotten. With the strength of lords, they challenged the dragons. Gwyn's mighty bolts peeled apart their stone scales. The witches weaved great firestorms. Nito unleashed a miasma of death and disease. Seeth the scales betrayed his own, and the dragons were no more.
began the Age of Fire. But soon the flames will fade, and only dark will remain. Even now, there are only embers, and man sees not light, but only endless nights. And amongst the living are seen carriers of the accursed dark side. That was some opening. Wow. <laughs> pretty, pretty heavy stuff. Ooh. Oh, great rats. Yes, indeed. The dark sign brands the undead. And in this land, The undead are corralled and led to the north. Where they are locked away to await the end of the world. This is your fate. Um, thanks, I think. Uh, pillage corpse, lovely. Oh, dungeon cell key. Okay, we're looking a little rougher than, uh, than I had <laughs> anticipated. But I believe it's because we are currently undead. I believe the term is... Oh, I actually don't know. Is it hallowed or what is it? I have a broken sword. But um, I can't remember. I, I know very little about these games. I learned a bit from my buddy Mark. And I've seen a couple people play these games uh, before. But I purposely never retained much of it. Because I knew I would play them myself sometime. But yeah, currently I think we are quote unquote undead, so we need to do something about that, I believe. Okay. Uh so how you guys doing? Not well, it would seem. Uh new passage. Camera controls. Yeah. So, one thing I should say, too, by the way, I am playing this in offline mode for a couple of reasons. One is that currently the servers for these games are actually down. I think they did this because of some sort of a safety thing that came up uh, recently. But um, I also intended to play it in offline mode so that we don't get the spoiler messages and warnings that players will leave. And also the invasions by other players because... I'm definitely not going to be ready for such a thing. That isn't to say that we will not try online mode at some point, but as of right now, I do not intend to. Um, I hear heavy footsteps. <laughs> RB is attack. What? Oh. Then what did I do? Oh, that's... <laughs> Oh, that must be heavy attack. Oh yeah, because it used stamina. So what's roll? 
That's not it. It's B. Okay. And you see it uses the stamina as you do it. Um, hey. Should I put you out of your misery, buddy? I guess I will. Okay, it was 20 souls. Oh, that's the heavy footsteps. Oh, yeah, look at you. You, um... Yeah. Yeah, no. No, thank you. No. No, I don't think I will. <laughs> Strong attack right there, gotcha. I feel bad, actually. These guys aren't really fighting back, but I feel like I'm just kind of doing them a favor at this point. Okay, so this is Dash. It uses up stamina. I got it. Probably won't use that too much until we get the lay of the land, because I don't want to like blunder into something I can't handle. Hello. What's going on? Target. Oh yeah, I didn't know about this. So, uh, how's it going? I think there's like a sneak attack thing, where if you hit him from behind, it kills him faster or something. Oh, oh gosh, right golf is it? <laughs> Uh, okay. I have a feeling we're making our way around to that big guy, and I really, really don't want to do that. Yet. Oh, Lord. That's probably exactly what's about to happen, isn't it? Eh. I don't want to. Rest at Bonfire Recover HP. Yes. So this is also the save system. For those who are unfamiliar, when you rest at a bonfire, uh, this is where you will respawn. Uh, so I'm, I'm, I'm not going to do anything because I don't have... But it also is a teleportation system like waypoints. So when I find another one, I can teleport between these. Uh, but the thing about it is, if you do die, the only thing you lose, I believe, are the souls. Uh, the things that you get from killing enemies. I have 60 currently. So I would lose those. They'd be on the ground at the spot I died. If I go back, I can pick them up again. But every time I die, I'm going to go back to the last bonfire that I spawned at. So learning these layouts of these places is going to be very crucial, especially if I don't find bonfires very often. I don't want to go in here. Is this not where that guy just was a second ago? Okay, I guess not. It is. Get away. Get away. Uh. Oh god. Oh, we're already in trouble. Oh, I see an open door. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Yeah, frick you, guy. <sighs> now, granted, I could have tried to fight him. But no. <laughs> oh, hey, look, another bonfire, so we don't have to deal with that again. You know, part of me, though, kind of... Wishes I could see how tough he is. Because I feel like there's one of those enemies at the beginning of every one of these games where you're meant to not be able to beat them. But if you do manage to somehow do it, you get like a really good item. Should I have tried? I really have no way of doing it though now, do I? Well, yeah, I guess I can teleport, right? No, I cannot. Okay. I guess I cannot. Well, it is what it is. Get your shield. Where's my shield? Is it in the water? Oh, it's probably in there. Oh god, somebody freaking shot me. How dare you? Um, how do I... 
Okay, browse and use items. Do I even have... Lose humanity and souls in return now. Do I have a shield? I don't yet. It's probably on that dude that I saw around the corner there. But I'm gonna get shot by this idiot in the meanwhile. Go ahead, shoot. Wow, those are, uh, those are very slow, my friend. Aha. Okay, so I have that. What does the message say? Oh, yeah. Got it. Uh. Tower Kite and Shield. Okay, and then how do I block? How do I block? Wait, hold on. That's that. Aha, like that. Gotcha. <laughs> God damn it. I should have just looked for the other symbol to see if there was something that was in the town. Alright. Thank you. Yeah, you better run. Yeah, you scary cat. Ooh, an actual sword. No, wrong button. We're gonna have to get used to this real quick. You're like still you're not actually paused, by the way. You're you're freaking um you're uh just kinda staying in there. Toggle weapons or toggle items change weapons, gotcha, yeah, yeah. So you can switch between them on the fly. Hey. How's it going? Gotcha. Off me, dude. <laughs> okay. Alright, so this is gonna seem real silly, but like, can I save in not have to deal with this hallway and picking up this shield and all this again? Probably seems pretty silly, but. Let's see if I can do it. Rest it long. Yeah. Alright, cool. I mean, actually, I think enemies always respawn. But at least I'll have the shield already. How you fricker. Back here. Yeah, thought you were gonna get away from me. I actually got twenty extra souls. For and yes, you can level grind, so to speak, by by collecting souls by repeating areas over and over again. And that's probably something we'll have to do at some point. Anyway, traverse the white light. What's gonna happen to us? I wonder. No, oh, we're just in here. It's oh. I'd like to get in there. That guy's got some gear I'd like to have, I think. Read the message. Yeah. Backstep. Oh. So yeah, if you're not moving when you press the roll button, you backstep. That is that is important to know. Uh, can I get into this? Though? I very much like to. Any enemies around? No. Nope, that's not what I need to do. Let me see if I can break in here because <clears throat> that guy's got some cut stuff. I don't think I'm gonna be able to. Okay. Uh. Mm hmm. Oh wait, this is oh. This is the the first bonfire. Okay, so would we get another chance? Are we gonna get another chance at that guy I saw then? I wonder. There's multiple pathways here. Yeah, this is taking us in here. I think we are gonna fight him now. Okay, so I was wrong. That wasn't something that we were skipping. It's just something we were getting equipped for, I guess. Now we've got a shield and sword, right? 
I, I kind of want to see what's on the upper staircase first before we make that terrible decision to go fight him. Actually, what's what's here? Is there something here? Anything hidden back here? No? Seemed like a great spot to hide something. Okay. So, oh, you jerk. Freaking bug. Get away from me. Alright, so we just got Indiana Jones. That was unpleasant. It did open this up. Oh, hey, this is the. <laughs> wow. Hey. Oh, you. You're no hollow. Thank goodness. I'm done for, I'm afraid. I'll die soon, then lose my sanity. I wish to ask something of you. You and I, we're both undead. Hear me out, will you? Regrettably, I have failed in my mission. But perhaps you can keep the torch lit. There is an old saying in my family. Thou who art undead art chosen. In thine exodus from the undead asylum, maketh pilgrimage to the land of ancient lords. When thou ringeth the bell of awakening, the fate of the undead thou shalt know. Well, now you know. And I can die with hope in my heart. Oh, one more thing. Here, take this. An Estus flask, an undead favorite. Oh, and this. Oh, thanks. Now I must bid farewell. I would hate to harm you after death. So go now, and thank you. So... Okay, he gave us our first healing thing, which is cool. Um, so you get five of these, and I believe... I believe that they renew... After a certain point. Oh. He just died, I think. Yeah. Um, so I think they renew every time you use a bonfire, is what it is. Now, if I go back up there, is he gonna be like, an angry man? Possibly. But we're not gonna do that, I guess. Although he might have good crap. He did have some really nice armor. But anyway. Hmm. <laughs> okay, so I guess now we have to fight this jerk in here. After all. Hey boy. You what? No. I, I wanna check I wanna check. I wanna check. I wanna check this guy first. I know he said, you know, I'd hate to harm you after death or whatever. Oh, he's just not there. He's just straight up gone. Rest at bomb fighter replenish as well. Yeah. Yeah, he just straight up gone. Huh. Oh, there you go. Stupid rock that has. Did we go up here? No, we didn't. It's where that thing came from. Is there anything? Oh, hi. I fell. Ow. Well, there's fall damage. <laughs> That's right. You frick. Um, okay. Aha, uh -huh, that's what the key is for, I see. Uh, wield right weapon two-handed. Kick jump attack. Oh boy. So many things that I'm not going to remember. I was thinking Bonfire revives enemies, yeah. Oh, hi. Oh, no. Arrows. Hey, 
RB while falling, plunging attack. Okay. Uh, so we took a bunch of damage that we should definitely replenish. So wait, do we? Can we just not fight that dude? Is that what I'm gathering here, or is this, this also lead into that room? Already behind an enemy is critical. Oh hi. Sup, dude. Parry. Okay. I don't know if I'll be able to pull that off, but I'll try. I did not pull it off, in fact. Did kill him, though. Uh, so we're badly injured again. <laughs> okay, this is locked, so I think we have to go this other way. Much as we might not want to. But do I go through the white door or do I go through the doors down here? I don't really know. But I do know that I'm badly hurt, so I'm gonna run back to this bonfire. I mean, I could S this flask, yes, but we're gonna need these for the fight. There is no two ways about that. We are gonna need these. Of course, all these idiots are gonna respawn. But I took so much fall damage, you know? But it is true, all these jerks are gonna respawn. Locked by something. Okay, so we are forced to get away. Alright, I, I wasn't sure. I wasn't sure. Um, but yes, yeah, so that means there's gonna be a guy up here. Hey. Okay. There's gonna be some dudes out here. See, if you can parry with that, then you follow it with an attack. It, I think, is like a crit or whatever. Alright, hey. dead, and I might as well take you out again, I guess. But be careful, this guy's a little bit more troublesome than some of them. Oh gosh, I pushed, pushed that wrong. Oh god. No! You jerk! Now I'm all the way down where I was before! Oh my lord. I see how this is going to be. I'm going to min-max this too much, probably. That's what's going to happen, right? That guy didn't come back, did you know? <laughs> um, yeah. I, mean, I get it, I can use my healing things, but like, we're about to fight a goddamn boss, right? So it's like, I feel like it's more important to keep them for that. I just won't go in. Whoa, this is a different place. What? What is this? I didn't. Or did I? Oh, I, wait, I cl yeah, I climbed up. The, did I? I don't remember. Yes, maybe? No? I remember climbing up a ladder. I just don't remember if it was that one. Anyway, moving on. I just won't go fight the guy with the sword and shield, because I don't need to. There's no need to do that. I got hit by this one, or an arrow, something. Dang it. Just had to, had to get in a lucky shot in there. 
You just had to do it. Alright, I'm not going in that room. Then. Still gonna be down a little health, but whatever, it's fine. Right? I definitely won't be murdered to death. Oh lord, hi. Hello. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh no, that was rude. So guess what? Um... I think I was supposed to do that lunging attack thing it said from but um I waited too long and he knocked me down. So we're gonna use one of these already. This is off to a great start. Well I did not dodge that attack at all. Oh dear. Okay, well, ouch. Oh, dear. Get up, get up, get up. Okay. okay I think I dodged that. Maybe, not really. Hey, bud. How's it going? Oh, boy. We are so slow, dude. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Get out of there. Um, we're down to one healing item. That's good. No more healing items. <laughs> Just so you know. I didn't get hit there, but I'll take it. Okay. No. I, I think not. No. That hit me. Just have to be patient. Oh god. No. Okay. The range on that is is crazy too. All right, what do you got? Okay, you doing that one? I'm always good for that one. I, I can figure that one out. <laughs> that one's a little harder. Yeah, I knew that follow up was coming. Go ahead, go ahead. Do that one, yeah. That hit me, okay. Okay. He's really almost dead though, so... I think as long as I... Oh, dodge that. Oh, he got in an extra hit I was not prepared for, but we did it! Yes! First try, even though I fricked it up. <laughs> oh, humanity. Oh, the humanity. Okay. Why do I still hear heavy footsteps? I'm not sure. Wait. If I rest at this bonfire, is he just going to come back to life? Because we don't want that. If that happens, oh dear. But like, 
I don't think it does with bosses, right? Just with regular enemies? There's no way he's just gonna be back in here. I keep hearing noise, man, and I don't like it. <laughs> okay. Can I leave here? Yes. What are these big footsteps? Is there something even bigger than him that's making all that noise? That would be terrible. <laughs> Dude, we, fir we first tried our first boss. Good job. Go straight ahead. Thanks. I don't hear the footsteps anymore, which tells me that there is something else above or below here. Yes. That's not a comforting thought. Because I thought that was him making that noise. Anyway, so yeah, the idea there is when we were up there looking down at him, I should have done the jump lunge thing. And I probably would have done a lot of damage to him to start with. Instead, I waited too long and he knocked me down. <laughs> so the fact that we lived through that was, was pretty cool, honestly. I probably should have not lived. But hey, here we are. Um, oh boy. Hey, it's like Breath of the Wild. Come up to the cliff and get a view and cutscene. Only in the ancient legends it is stated that one day an undead shall be chosen. To leave the undead asylum in pilgrimage to the land of the ancient lords. Lordran. Okay. <laughs> we were taken by a giant bird. I wasn't sure how to react, but it seems friendly, I guess. They did a good job with this remaster, though. I mean, it still feels, you know, it kind of looks and feels like an older game, because it is. But it looks really good, what they did with it. They kept a lot of, I think, the aesthetic while just polishing it up, which is really nice. Mordren, level up and kindle at bonfires. Okay. Hi. What's up? Well. What do we have here? You must be a new arrival. Let me guess. Fate of the undead, right? Well, you're not the first. But there's no salvation here. You'd have done better to rot in the undead asylum. But too late now. <sighs> well, since you're here, let me help you out. There are actually two bells of awakening. One's up above in the undead church. The other is far, far below, in the ruins at the base of Blight Town. Ring them both, and something happens. Brilliant, right? Not much to go on. But I have a feeling that won't stop you. So, off you go. It is why you came, isn't it? To this accursed land of the undead? <laughs> I don't know if I like you, <laughs> uh, but let's definitely rest here. All right, so I don't know exactly what Covenant and Kindle mean. Reverse Halloween, I guess, makes us not a zombie or whatever, but we can level up. Um, huh, what do we level up, though, right? Uh... Let's see. Explanation. Oh. No, I... T what? Oh, I see that I scrolled through. Alright, so vitality is HP. We know that. Attunement. Determining number of attunement slots. Okay, endurance. 
Okay, endurance does control stamina. Equipment load, resistance to bleeding, strength, dexterity, required to wield advanced weapons and boost weapon attack, resistance to poison and just de defense in general, uh, intelligence, sorceries, faith, card cast miracles, humanity. Symbolizes human nature and determines item discovery and resistance to curses. Oh. Interesting. Okay, so that's that's good to know. Uh, so I think we definitely want to up our endurance for our stamina. We're gonna do that too. Uh, I'm gonna do one. Hmm. Uh, yeah. Hmm. So I think I'm going to do three. I think I'm going to put three into endurance. Yeah. I'm not sure if it's the best first choice I could have made, but that's the choice I have made, so. Except. It did stick, right? Yeah, so far. Uh, so what does this stuff mean? Way of White. Can be kindled while hollow. Reverse hollowing. See, I don't know what this stuff means. I wish it would tell me, you know? I mean, I think, like I said, I think it means not how I'm going to be a zombie anymore. No humanity. Oh, I had to have... Uh, I see. I would have had to have put points into humanity or something. Well, didn't I get... Hold on. Didn't I get... Yeah. Used to gain one humanity plus greatly restore HP. Oh, so that's probably something I should wait to use then. We now have 10 Estus Flasks, though. That's really good. Okay, well, I guess we'll stay a zombie a little bit longer. Oh, that's the bird. I was like, what is that I'm seeing? <laughs> it's the bird that brought us here, the raven or whatever. What about this guy? Can we kill this guy? Should we kill this guy? Probably not, right? I'm gonna assume not. I didn't like his attitude, but on the other hand, he's probably right. He's probably terrible things ahead of us. Oh, three more humanity, just like that. Kinda makes me wanna see what that does. <laughs> I don't know where to go. So he said, down into the depths, is is one and then up in the church ahead so i'm guessing that's the next place we're meant to go then does this well go somewhere i don't know um yeah i guess i'm just going here it's probably going to be like the statue is going to freaking come to life and try to murder our faces Hey. I can't talk to you. I don't want to attack you. You seem nice. Break the bases. Uh. Can I go across this? Oh, I can. Okay. I wasn't sure how deep that was. There's an empty. Empty chest. Statue. Okay, doesn't seem to be much here, to be honest. Hmm. Up in the church ahead, he says, there's a bell. But I don't see a bell. Is there a way to get up there? Oh, there's more stairs over here. 
probably explore every avenue before I decide. Thank you.